Hi there, I'm Father Pollard. We're St. John the Beloved in McLean, Virginia. At the Transfiguration, Jesus took Peter, James, and John up Mount Tabor. It's a huge hill. It would have taken them hours to walk up. It's just east of Nazareth in the Jezreel Valley. Our Lord probably would have seen it every day of his childhood. We read about the Transfiguration in Matthew 17, Mark 9, Luke 9. One of my favorite parts is the reaction of St. Peter. He's overwhelmed with fear and delight. And he says, Lord, it is good that we are here. Let us build three booths, one for you, one for Moses, one for Elijah. And the Gospels tell us he didn't really know what he was talking about. Jesus calls all of his disciples to prayer, to be with him. And sometimes he called just the apostles to gather with him in prayer, and at other times, just a few of them to be with him in a special place. Jesus is always waiting for you in the tabernacle. So this summer, as we're going to church every Sunday, every holy day of obligation, you know, August 15th is a Tuesday this year, it's a holy day. We, um, we need to find out where we're gonna be ahead of time, and if we're traveling, where the church is nearby. So go to masstimes.org, find where the churches are nearby make a plan. When I'm traveling, I usually look for the churches that advertise adoration. Wherever you go into church, you see the sanctuary lamp on or the veil over the tabernacle, you know there are lords there. Sometimes you'll see him enthroned on the altar in adoration. That'll be your challenge for the week. Find out where near your home, where near your office, where near your vacation spot there's a church and where there's adoration. And then come Get on your knees, let's go. Okay, be honest now. Does that button make me look fat? Well, go ahead and click on it. Subscribe to Two Minutes to Virtue.